Hello and welcome to the Futures 3D video training series. My name is Jeff Christiana and this is video number two of the Adreno 23 video series on how to use Adreno 23 to edit, compile, and upload your firmware. So we're going to go ahead and open up Adreno. Then we're going to open up our firmware. This will be Marlin Release Candidate 2. We're going to open up Marlin.pde. It's going to open up a second window. Close the other one. So let's say you want to come into Configuration H. Make a change. Let's go in here and uh, change this date. Today is June 19th. Now that you've made a change, this little symbol will appear saying that you haven't saved. When you do a sketch verify compile, it'll all do an auto save. We'll go up here to file, do a save. The little symbol disappears. Now you can go up to sketch verify compile. You'll see down below it'll say compiling. Let me show you this while it's compiling. Go up to Tools, Board. Right now we're compiling for a Adreno Mega 1280. If you have an Adreno Mega 2560, you want to make sure you check this. If you have a 1280, you want to make sure you want to check that. And the way to tell what one you have is you can look at the face of the Adreno board the large chip in the center you'll see that it will say 1280 or it will say 2560 you need to make sure that you have the right one if you compile for a 2560 and you have a 1280 when you try to upload it it won't upload it won't cause any damage it just won't upload so you can just recompile again and upload and you'll be good to go now you've compiled your code you see down below it says done compiling you see there's no errors so now you want to do is connect to your Adreno board so go to tools serial port and select the COM port at which your computer detected the Adreno board so I'm going to check that COM69 and you're going to want to click on this upload button here we'll go ahead and click on that now on your Adreno board there will be two LEDs that you'll see flashing. There is a receive, an RX, and a TX that will be toggling back and forth on and off showing the firmware uploading. If you have your ramps board on the top, uh, there should be an LED on your ramps board, a single LED, I believe it's LED1, that will flash to indicate the software being uploaded to your Adreno board. You don't have to do a compile. When you do, when you click on this arrow to do an upload, automatically does a compile, as you can see here, um, and then it'll do an upload. So it says done uploading. So now let's go ahead and verify. We'll go ahead and check this date. We'll open up Replicator G. Okay, here's Replicator G. It's already tried to connect. 69. We'll go ahead and scroll up. And there you go. 619 2012. So that is how you edit, compile, and upload your firmware to your Adreno board. We will uh, see you in the next movie. Thanks.